Tokyo Electric Power Company has retracted its announcement that 10 million times the normal density of radioactive materials had been detected in water at the number two reactor of the Fukushima Daiichi nuclear plant. Earlier on Sunday, Tokyo Electric Power Company said that extremely high levels of radioactive substances had been detected in leaked water that accumulated in the basement of the number two reactor's turbine building. It said 2.9 billion becquerels per cubic centimeter had been detected in the leaked water. But on Sunday evening, it said that data for iodine-134 announced earlier in the day was actually for another substance that has a longer half-life. The company will conduct another test of the leaked water at the reactor's turbine building. By taking new samples, we are trying to determine if the leaked material is iodine-134. But as of now, it is not certain that it is iodine-134. It said although the initial figure was wrong, the water still has a high level of radioactivity of 1,000 millisieverts per hour. And it's 8 p.m. on a Sunday night. Welcome to this hour's Newsline. I'm James Tengon in Tokyo. Exceedingly high levels of radioactive substances have been detected in puddles of water in the number two reactor's turbine building in Fukushima. The water contains 10 million times the usual level of radioactivity inside the operating nuclear reactor. The restoration of cooling systems may now be delayed due to the excessive levels of radioactivity. Lights were turned on in the central control of the number two reactor yesterday evening for the first time in about two weeks. But very high levels of radioactive substances have been detected in the turbine building of the number two reactor. Tokyo Electric Power Company analyzed a water sample taken from puddles on the basement floor. The official of the Nuclear and Industrial Safety Agency says the surface of the water showed levels of radioactivity higher than 1,000 millisieverts on March 26th in the turbine building of the number two reactor. This official from Tokyo Electric Power Company says the levels of radioactivity exceeded the upper reading limit of the gauge. The sample water indicated 2.9 billion becquerels of radioactivity, which is about 10 million times the usual levels of an operating nuclear reactor. It is about 1,000 times that of water on the floors of the turbine buildings of the number one and number three reactors. The substances include iodine-134, iodine-131, and cesium-134, which are usually generated during nuclear fission inside a reactor. The substances associated with the number two reactor indicated high levels of radioactivity, although the plant halted operations a half month ago. Professor Naoto Sekimura of Tokyo University Graduate School says he assumes that radioactive substances leak from damaged fuel rods and were dissolved in the water inside the pressure container. He says he thinks the radioactive water seeped outside the container and caused a serious problem. He says radioactive levels are currently too high for workers to stay. Professor Sekimura also said immediate efforts must be made to determine how the radioactive substances leak from the reactor. Suppression chambers are connected to the container of the reactor. An explosion in a suppression chamber on March 15th may have partially destroyed the containment functions of the suppression chamber of the number two reactor. Tokyo Electric said they cannot deny that high levels of radioactivity are related to the malfunctioning suppression chamber, but they don't know exactly what has happened. The company said the current data doesn't indicate that a massive amount of radioactive substances is leaking from the reactor. More than 1,850 times the government safety standard for iodine-131 was detected in a water sample taken from the sea 330 meters from the water discharge point of the Fukushima Daiichi nuclear power plant. The radioactive levels exceeded 1,000 times the standards at the same point for two consecutive days. High levels of radioactivity may cause delays in the restoration process of cooling systems. 
Tokyo Electric Power Company has retracted its announcement that 10 million times the normal density of radioactive materials had been detected in water at the number two reactor of the Fukushima Daiichi nuclear plant. Exceedingly high levels of radioactive substances have been detected in puddles of water in the number two reactor's turbine building in Fukushima. The water contains 10 million times the usual level of radioactivity inside the operating nuclear reactor. Tokyo Electric Power Company has retracted its announcement that 10 million times the normal density of radioactive materials had been detected in water at the number two reactor of the Fukushima Daiichi nuclear plant.